Robin Harris. Bay Bay children. <laughs> Robin Gibbons. Bay Bay. No, Robin Harris. Bay Bay children. So these may be some Bay Bay children. Your inner child may be a Bay Bay child. Like we just talked about. Hopefully, people want to heal their inner child. So, you know, you got some little Bay Bay masculine feminine running up inside you 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 know just it's just time to heal it that's it that's all it's just time to heal it you should never and we talked i talked about that yesterday you should never be ashamed of healing from coming out of the dark to the light because without that darkness, you wouldn't be able to become a better you, a healed self, a loving self, self-love. We also talk about that, the words of affirmation that came out. <clears throat> Teaching your child to look in the mirror and say really positive things to their themselves. Trust me, that's a part of the things that really kapuyao, kick me in the, the spiritual gonads that um was really eye opening for me is when I did look in the mirror and I was like <clears throat> and I was like um you are the best thing to ever happen to this universe you know these are things that I was telling myself you are loved you are divinely guided and supported you are divinely guided and supported so you know when I did these things then things were triggered and you know it was not only a learning process for me it was a learning process for my children because when I started loving myself and I didn't want to be toxic in a toxic relationship you know what I mean it it became eye opener for them that you know, mom's changing for better and somebody doesn't want her to change and be controlling and vindictive and, you know, just in a toxic and unhealed way. I didn't want to do that. And, you know, the combativeness that came out of that was just an eye-opening experience. Also, um, well, I really definitely decided to uh, heal. I split it on this. I'm going to show you. And this lady was like, my my Reiki healer, I'm going to keep on bringing her up because she was definitely another life lesson I learned. She was like, oh, I'm so powerful. I was breaking the gems and da 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 da. You don't need crystal gems. No, she didn't want me to protect myself was the thing. But you know what I'm saying? Just like I said, you you want to say one thing and then take it back like no it don't help no this is that look spirit is like yes i almost got a deaf ear ring that time spirit was like yes so this is what you know me and my kids decided to do and this is what our goal was past present and future reiki healing this is a sign that you can use um go research for reiki healing it helps with the past, present, and the future, which is the here and now. You can choose to heal here and now. And you, like, nothing really matters what you've done for the past. Yeah, you got to go through that karmic deal of what you did in the past to heal because that's what you have created for yourself. It was a, um, you know, maybe you were ignorant to the fact of what was going on at that time and moment. Uh, you know, you did it free willingly, maybe you didn't, you know, but how we talk about lies and deception, how people will say, uh, what is good for the goose is not good for the gander type of deal. She didn't want me to protect myself. And I've talked about that story of how she was actually, she was like, well, where are you at? And I was like, well, I mean, I'm in California. I wouldn't tell her exactly where I was at. And I was just like, I didn't want to tell nobody where I was at. I was told not to. And um, and then I hear her go, oh, shit. And I was like, what? 
confirmation. And um, she was like, my pendulum broke. And then it came to me like a flood. After she tried to charge me uh, $1,200 for my master's class and to get my recertification, not my recertification, my actual uh, printout of me taking my Reiki level one and two. So needless to say, she's blocking me from my money. See how that works out for her. Um, because you can actually get a, um, a position in a hospital working as a Reiki healer. So, you know what I'm saying? They will tell you things. She did that. And then I, I went later on to the shelter to find out how my gym had broken. And I was like, what the fuck? And then I was like, damn, okay, she... She don't like me. I forgot that she even liked me, but us as empaths and uh, whatnot, we are so forgiving and so healing um, that, you know, we just, and then not only that, when they're doing black magic, oh, that was another thing that came out with Aaliyah. They were doing magic on her. She was like having dizzy spells, putting something in her drink and, you know, having her addicted or she was addicted because she was being abused. Trauma by trauma bonded child, which is also when you have been uh, abused by your captor and they like somebody bow, like hitting you and saying, oh, no, you're OK, you're fine you know and then also talk to your children about that type of manipulative behavior and different codes for them in order to you know really heal from that and or come to you or um in that manner when stuff like that happens because people will abuse you and then be like oh no it's okay come here you know i love you and really trying to stab you in your back that's where we get the stabbing in the back the trauma bonding the uh, Stockholm Syndrome child um, you know a lot of us have come from Stockholm Syndrome so we you know people think it's okay for um, abusing abusing mentally physically spiritually financially emotionally we when we don't heal from these things we pass these on to our generations and they become generational curses which has to do with the Akashic Records so this is how we're trying to purge and heal the inner child of ourselves mainly in order to pass the information on to other people. So this is uh, Jose Shanin. Jose Shanin. This is Jose Shanin. It means uh, oh, distant healing. Present, past, and future. So you can use this for distant healing. You can... <clears throat> I would say... As far as the imagination goes, say if you're, because I know in some cases the child's soul could leave the body, you know, in certain traumas or that part of them is feeling like, you know, like sad, depressed, scared, fearful, so it's not in them. Oh, okay, I see where you're going. It's not in them to even know the fight or flight. So that's why it's important to know the healing process on this in order for them to gain back their natural senses. Woo! Yeah, I split it on that. And that's that's that that's deep. That is that goes so deep. That's why I said that's like more of a hypnotherapy that's what I was trying to get to earlier but I was like ding 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 it's coming through um hypnotherapy Akashic records past life you know what I mean your waking life when you go to sleep that's what you're living in that's because it's unhealed so spat wait Yeah. Robbed of childhood memories. This did come out yesterday too in the read. Robbed of childhood memories. I wouldn't doubt it. Robbed of 
robbed of childhood memories, robbed of childhood memory, memories. Why did I put, I put it twice? So this could have happened to somebody twice. Because it's, I, I wrote it down twice. We'll see what goes on the back of these um, as Spirit gives me more downloads. But I do want to pull some more cards on what does the collective need to know for healing? Oops. What does the collective need to know for healing uh, childhood traumas in the inner child? What does the collective need to know? Oh. Call it a fast. Call it a fast. What is the childhood rumors? So it could be some rumors. I know I have rumors. Uh, told about me which really led me to be outspoken in a toxic way which you know we all go through our little bouts of this is why I'm trying not to cuss because I use cussing as a venting way but that's not good as well because those are also curses and the words we speak need to be healing that was also um card that came out yesterday speak words of beauty and you will be there in the re no matter what anybody says it's what matters is what you think of yourself get it together you ought to heal your body get it together you have to heal your body yeah. It's trying to come out again. Move backwards too. You have to heal your heart, yeah. Whatsoever you saw you will read. Get it together. The choice is yours. No matter what it is. The choose life is to choose to forgive. You don't wanna Try to hurt him or break his pride. Just shake that weight off and you'll be ready to fly. Let's see my throat dry just a little bit. We shall tear your heart without breaking your skin. No one has the power to hurt you like your friends. My future ahead of me, that's what they say. I'll be starving if I ate all the lies that they fed. Now I've been redeemed by your English name. A miracle child of flowing through the clouds. Namaste. <laughs> Namaste. See, we all namaste in here, for real. We all namaste and namaste and namaste must die. Namaste, namaste, namaste. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. And this is what you be can become. You ain't got to be a burger. You ain't got to eat a troll to be happy. Once you start healing, you know, healing hurts. We have to talk about that a lot. Because people just think, oh, because she got a smile on her face. Or, you know, saying, got a million dollars in my pocket. Does not mean that healing does not hurt. In order to get to the joy and the beauty. And learn how to get there again and also be there. Find a way to get there, even in the darkest of times and the, the stressful of hours and minutes and moments and seconds. So, no matter what it is, the here and now, the past, present, and the future, we had to go through that in order to become this, in order to be this in a in a alkaline way, right? was learning how to be a joyful, jolly child on the inside. Wait. 
yeah, these also came out. I didn't, oh, booty backwards came out, hot and cold. And you know, you can't be hot. You can't be hot. Either it's like, it's like, you're going to be, you're either going to be all in or you're going to be out. Yes or no. Either you're going to be hot about it and light about it. You know what I'm saying? Or you're going to just be no, you're going to be cold about it. You know? You're going to have an ice box where your heart used to be type time. Rumors. Either you can go with the rumors or you can heal from the rumors. Biggie Smalls. You can grow from it or you can, you know, it's like pick your poison type thing. You're going to be honest. You're going to be truthful. You know, you're going to be accountable for your own actions. Uh, what do you choose to do? What path do you choose to take? <sighs> Great enlightenment. And then only that did that. She had me thinking, this Reiki healer had me thinking that I could not go and get these anywhere else but from her. Now, if anybody has you on a, you know, if you like that person's energy work and you like that person's healing, that's one thing. But for somebody to have you think that only this person can do it, is that only their gift though? That's why it's important to do your own research and, you know, it's just something that wasn't brought to my attention at the time that I'm constantly being reminded of as well you know I need to go do the heat uh, the research could I have I mean even if I did it was still more of a, a hindrance on my finance as far as getting a, a a really great job right so she was causing blockages in more than one way So this sign right here is great enlightenment. And also what comes with this energy work is calling off all dark energy. You want to really cleanse and detox. Mind, body, soul, what you intake and, you know, just really detox. And vegan is the best way to do that. To purge away any sickness, any ailment, you know. Or whatnot. So, decol meal, decol yo, de decol mo, moi, decol moi, master symbol. So, great enlightenment master symbol. And then what came out yesterday was also the student symbol. So these are symbols that you can look up and study and research the meaning of them and how you can use to heal yourself, to heal your child. And I would just say, again, I would definitely highly recommend that you do the research yourself and you do the healing work yourself because the energy is also within you and you know your true intent for your child. So I would not put that in anyone else's hands. Wait. Oh, okay. Joyful, jolly child. Chakras knocked into alignment. So we talk about the chakras knocked into alignment and how we can go about healing. <laughs> uh, no broken hearted queen. So you don't have to be a broken hearted queen. Or king. Oh, this came out again. Daughter uh, of the Most High, Aaliyah. And that's what her name means, too. Daughter of the Most High. Her name means Daughter of the Most High. That's why I put it like that. <sighs> oh, no, I was going through the ones that are in my hands. Crying tears of joy. So there will be tears of joy, tears of healing, tears of sadness, anger, all of the above. Trust me, I went through it. And let me tell you, August 
when the lion gate portal opened, I was like, rawr, <laughs> shit, what the hell going on around here? Spiritual justice, right? Tears of joy are spiritual justice as well. So you can have spiritual justice. And I like this one. And these all came out upright. But those came out first. Those were the ones that fell on the ground. <clears throat> and these were the ones that are up. So... Mature spiritually. This will help you to grow and mature, uh, mature spiritually and know who is spiritually mature as well. Learning from my experiences, I don't mind sharing. Because, <clears throat> you know, once you grow from it, you heal from it, it's no longer a weakness. It can be a trigger, but the more you heal, the less you are triggered. And that can be alcohol, that can be drugs, that can be sex, because sex also did come out. Um, past, present, and future, say in your past life, if this trauma happened to you, you can also heal from it here and now and break that generational curse. 47 Ronin. This may be for an older child, I don't know. I don't mind what my children watch. So 47 Ronin, because there's a storyline for everybody in, you know, in how they can express. And, you know, we are multi-dimensional beings. So, you know, we, we all gather information from these different things. 47 Ronin. Mature spiritually. Oh, okay. Mature spiritually. Because I was talking about my green print, right? Only I have the green print for. So, um, I did post that on my Facebook. So, I posted on three. I tagged myself in the one I don't have access to. Um, real, I think it's, I think it's KD, Real Spiritual, or no, it's Karma. With the abbreviate, with the first initial of Real Spiritual Bosses Help. Facebook. And then I have another one, Illis Tyler, which is I, I L L E S T. Illis Tyler. So. And now since they have it to where, you know, you can really don't have to go into that person's profile and see it from the outside. I probably won't even accept no friend requests because I don't even hardly have no friends on the ones that I do have access to now. And I know it's a lot of my my friends that was on there got deleted, but I know I deleted a lot of them before I got lost access to it. Um, okay, so... <clears throat> <laughs> bro tell me that's what that is bro tell me abusing child for money wow so you can have somebody abusing child for money so they could be we talk about another way of financially abusing children um financially abusing children like you know uh sexually mentally or physically abusing them or spiritually abusing them and saying hey i'm gonna give you this money that could be somebody doing that to your inner child you can be grown call yourself grown as i don't know what you can be 45 you can be 34 you can be whatever 55 you can be 78 of somebody abusing your inner child your masculine your feminine within you And saying, okay, well, I'm gonna be you. I'm gonna cheat on you, but I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna buy you some roses, honey. It's okay. You can stay with me. Oh, I can Tina. Nah, num, yo, they ain't get killed. That's funny because I did make a card like that too. I made a num, yo, they ain't get killed card. And I forgot the meaning of it, but you can um, look that up too. That is also a uh, 
um, a vibration of healing your, your inner your inner child. NSA hack. NSA hack. NSA hack. Hear them out. Wow. Reconcile. And then we have on the back of Reconcile, three to six years old. So these are some of the things that could have happened at three to six years old, or to your child at three to six years old, or to a child around you at three, at three, well, three to six years old. Super hybrid. And then we have water. That can also apply to three, six years old. And that can also. I'm just seeing. NSA hack. Somebody could hack the child's phone too. Yeah, they begin shooting these tablets and these phones and stuff and hear them out. Oh my gosh, that's reminding me. That's reminding me um, of the cameras put in people's homes. So... So, of course, there's cameras on tablets, there's cameras on the phones, there's cameras on cameras, and then people that can hack into cameras. Hmm. Wonder who that could be. Karmic FBI. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Karmic FBI. Karmic debt from past life. Karmic debt from past life. So this can be an FBI agent, which we have been getting a lot of ear ringings of the FBI hacking, people spiritually hacking, abusing their gifts, hacking, spying. Little King Cry Wolf. Wow. Little King Cry Wolf, Divine Time, they're supposed to put timing times 10, Divine Timing times 10, mm. give their, give their shirt off their back, off, oh wait, it says give the shirt off their soul. Little King Cry Wolf get the shirt off their soul. And then Sagittarius come out. Who did that? Oh. They go like a piece of fruit. They go like a piece of fruit. Scorpio. Ah. Uh, aromatherapy. Ah. <sighs> aromatherapy. Oh, didn't I say it? Stockholm Syndrome, a.k.a. Trauma Bonding. Yes. Experience. See, this is something somebody experienced. Direct and precise. This was direct and precise. Which they are very calculated when these type of beings do these type of things. 
they need to, 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 to strategically design but only I have the green print for looks like I'm going for a thing hair get your thirst quench aqua 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 the color aqua aqua clothes aqua painted room aqua gem colors we also talk about using gems so that can okay voicing your opinion right speaking up for yourself so colors of blue that has to do with the blue chakra <clears throat> can help you also heal that chakra as well so that is a good thing <laughs> i don't think it's by coincidence timid child for timid children um for children that have became timid for the timid child in you learn how to express which i'm learning how to express without cuss words this will happen this so molded be I will stop cussing <laughs> do that potty dance sheet show came out yesterday sheet show is an expression of a childlike way of expressing it because it's more directed for children as well as adults so there's no cussing Phoenix Rising. So, Phoenix Rising. This has to do also with death and rebirth. Uh, <clears throat> death and rebirth. Um, yin, yang, hot, cold. Death and rebirth. Phoenix Rising. Rise up. And if you fall, get back up again. Anxious child. Be anxious for healing. If you're dealing with an anxious child, you can also use patchouli, lavender. You can also use eucalyptus. Like I said, do your own research on these different oils and herbs and things like that that can be used. I did do a little magic. It was mad as well. Anyway. Came right back. I thought I got pay out. I was like, ooh. I was like, eee. Let me worry about me. Uh, what is that sound for? Oh, I don't know where I shut up. Spiritual <laughs> confirmation. <laughs> Spiritual 